so what do I do? Just touch it? I touch it? I touched it. What happened? Hey everybody, so it finally happened. I got myself on Uber Eats. So if you are new to my channel and you haven't watched past videos, I have had so much trouble trying to get on Uber Eats because they wouldn't accept my documents. There was always some kind of problem according to them. So I would call the support number and I would never get through to anybody. Well, last week, to my surprise, someone answered. And so I got to speak to someone. I actually spoke to two people. The first person I spoke to was able to fix my insurance card for me. Um, but then she had to hand me off to a manager to handle my driver's license because for some reason they can't see it. And they were even having me at that time that I was on the phone with them take another picture to send to them. I did it like three times and they, I guess still couldn't see it. And I don't know why because it was perfectly clear from what I could see. So anyways, 40 minutes on the phone with them, got fixed except for my profile picture. So that I had to retake because they didn't accept the uh, original one that I put in. I guess, I guess they're matching it to your driver's license photo and I weighed less in my driver's license photo. So I suppose I had to try to look skinnier when I took my profile picture to match. You understand what I'm saying? So today is Tuesday. It's not a day I normally dash. I'm only going to come out here for like two hours just to test the Uber Eats app because I haven't used it. I haven't watched any videos on how to use it. I don't know how to use it. So I'm going to be learning how to use it as you watch me. What do you call it? It's not a dash. What do you call it? What do you call it when you're, you're Uber eating? I'm an Uber eater today. Okay, so let me get into the app. Let me get in it. Okay, so go. Oh no, I have required actions. Take a photo of yourself. Here we go, now I'm gonna tr try to look skinny again. Fit your face in the guide. Okay, what now? Do I have to tap something? Oh, I gotta tap the circle. Okay, I'm myself. Excellent, thanks for verifying. You're online. Okay, I'm online. Finding trips. All right, here's the first one. $8, one cent, 14 minutes, 1.8 miles for Starbucks. So what do I do, just touch it? I touch it, I touched it. What happened? Why didn't I get the order? What the hell? All right, so I'm playing with like the buttons. Oh, look at my nail. Let me not, oh, all my nails are terrible. Like it says request paused and now it won't like unpause. Like how do, how do I unpause it? How do I unpause it? Is there anything else I can help you with today? Person, agent, operator. Before I connect you, please say your date of birth for verification. Um, yeah, I mean, if is it going to tell me how to get to their house and everything? Is it going to be like yeah, background sure. or anything? Uh, I will going to be also connecting the customer on the other line as well, so you can ask the customer's personal address. So you can deliver, and you can, uh, uh, once you have delivered a customer's order, you will going to call us back to help you to end the trip and to complete the delivery and to make sure that you are still going to get paid. Can I just, can you just remove it from me and I can just wait for the next order? Seven. 
4.2 miles for a smoothie king. I'm gonna decline that one too. Alrighty everybody, so I have come to a different part of town to see if I could maybe get orders over here. I still haven't got anything since that $4 one that you saw me decline. Oh, here goes one. Okay, $16.96. It's 7.6 miles for Soho Juice Company. Um, okay, let's just do it. What's going to happen now? Nope, it disappeared from the screen. Um, something went wrong. Ain't that some shit? Ain't that some shit? Well, you know what? Let me pull over somewhere. I think I'm gonna need a soda. <laughs> Let me pull over somewhere. And, um, I mean, do I have to call support again now? Cause that's gonna be like, it's gonna, it's gonna be still showing as I have it. Okay, so I accepted, I don't even remember how much it was. Six dollars maybe? I don't know, but it's for Chick-fil-A and Chick-fil-A is just half a mile away. So let's go pick it up. And there's this lady, like I'm, I'm I came and parked behind a McDonald's cause like, and she's like wandering around. Like it's me and there was like another truck pulled up over here as well. And she's kind of like, just like wandering around us like really strangely. And like she, there's another car parked that doesn't have anybody in it. And she was like, look, she was like looking in the windows of the car. Suspicious. Okay, so I'm on the map screen. I'm on my way to Chick-fil-A. I have no idea. Oh shoot, I ain't gonna be able to make it. Ah! I'm sorry! Please, please wait a minute. <laughs> okay. Okay, this map. Am I, oh, oh it's rerouting. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Make a right turn, then make a right turn on 4th Street North. That's what I'm doing, so why are you rerouting? What do I do now? I'm here. Do I hit Chick-fil-A? No. I'm here. I'm here! What do I do? I'm not arriving soon. I'm here. Okay. I don't know what I hit. But now it's showing me note from the business. And it's like this whole paragraph. And then it gives me the customer's name. It's one item. Oh, you can say, how was your pickup? thumbs down or thumbs up and then start delivery okay so not start delivery yet first I have to get it all right start delivery start delivery start it start delivery I'll swipe it oh my god you have to swipe it drop off at 500 7th Avenue why are you telling the address <laughs> 13 minutes 13 minutes, 3.7 miles. Let's go, everybody. Green light. She says it's the 500 building. Oh, I see it. It's, it's not Bayfront, it's John Hopkins. Drop off on the right. I think I see her waiting too. So what do I do to complete it? It says arriving soon. Drop off type meet at door. Do I? <coughs> what do I do? Arriving soon. Let's finish this delivery. Delivered. Okay, and it doesn't tell me how much I made. Oh, my throat. Excuse me. It doesn't tell me how much I made. Confirm it's my account. Oh, $3.10. I have to take a photo of myself. Oh my God. <coughs> Gosh. What did that lady do to me, man? She got me with a pinch in my throat. So I think when I accepted it, I think it was like six something. So it's showing 310. All right, $5, 1.6 miles. It's for Old Southeast Market. I'm 
gonna accept it. Head to your pickup at Old Southeast Market, downtown St. Petersburg. You gonna tell me how to get there? is over here um, I'm just trying to get turned around because I drove past it just like I drove past the market and she's looking at me she's looking at me from her balcony like what is this idiot doing okay it's a leave at the door but since she's already peeking at me I'm gonna leave you here Okay, so let me turn you around. You know, so $2, three points, whatever that means. Like, I feel like an idiot. I feel like an idiot going around with this app because like I brought it to the door and then I'm like, what do I do? Like, I, so I tap, you know, leave a door and nothing happens so I start going down the steps to walk away and then it pops up the thing that says take a picture so then it has to go back up the steps to take a picture like this lady's probably like oh my god she goes past the house she comes back she goes up the stairs she goes down, down the stairs I don't know what I'm doing so I'm new here radar what does that mean I3 13 miles for five dollars and sixty cents oh my god and y'all you know where I am exactly where I don't like to be where I don't like to be I hate this part down right here I sure do so one just popped on my screen it was for nineteen dollars and something cents it was for three deliveries um, and before I could even accept it, it disappeared. It had the eye thing that had the little number three next to it again. So that means somebody else took it. Like, that is so not awesome. That is so not awesome. Like, why are you offering it to multiple people at one time? Huh? Why? Like, what's the purpose of that? You know, like I'm driving and an order pops up. You got to give me more than like two seconds to like look at what it is before I accept it. I accepted an order. It was $6, maybe some change. I don't remember. 4.4 miles I'm picking up from Salem Eats. accepted a Chick-fil-A. It was for $8.06, I think. I'm not sure. I don't remember what the miles were. It's two miles to the Chick-fil-A, so I don't remember what the miles were. They don't give you enough time to, like, look at this screen. Instead of doing like I usually do with the dash where I'm just sitting somewhere and I go through the things, I'm actually on my way back home because I have to uh, work today, so I'm trying to, I'm trying to hurry up. So um, I ended my oob. Um, in one part of the app, I'll, sh I'll show some, some screenshots if I remember to do them. One part says I earned $19 and something, and then the other part says I earned $23 coming to a light so let me let me open it real fast and I'll show you um, okay so it's showing my earnings as 
$23.41 if you can see that and it's for that was for two hours and 44 minutes it was four trips 12 points I don't know what the points mean so um, if you are familiar with that please let me know um, looking at the four trips only three of the trips actually had tips one of them didn't but I think the one that doesn't have a tip like it like that's just what I accepted it for so I don't know how to identify when it's a no tip on Uber Eats does it tell you on the screen like tip included or I don't know I felt really rushed trying to decide whether to accept the orders so I don't like that I like how DoorDash has it better where you've got more time I mean with DoorDash I can get an order to my screen look at it turn on the GoPro start recording tell y'all what it is and still have time to accept it it's not like that with Reads. it's like it just feels really rushed like I like I didn't really have a chance to really like look at what everything it said so I don't like that um, I don't like the fact that you don't you're accepting something for a certain amount of money and you don't know if that's how much money you're getting because they can take the tip away you know what I mean I don't like that I don't like that they have however much time afterward to, to change it I don't like that either so I mean like $23 in two hours and 45 minutes like what's that gonna be eight or nine dollars an hour now mind you I did have all those problems at the beginning uh, with the app so an entire hour was wasted so you could say it was more like an hour and 45 minutes so that would change it but um, still not good still not good uh, a lot of orders I did get a lot of orders like you know but they weren't good like most of them were small and the miles were high so I don't know it's hard to really you know just do the app for a few hours and to make a determination if it's any good for you know the area that I'm in or not I know a lot of you really like Uber Eats and prefer Uber Eats over DoorDash at this point I do not I prefer DoorDash and so I don't know when I go out on the weekends um, if, if I'm going to have them both on at the same time I'll probably try it just to see um, but that might cause me too much stress <laughs> I'm not trying to be stressed so it might just be like Uber Eats is kind of just like the DoorDash backup you know I don't know I don't know we'll see how it pans out in a quarter mile your destination will be on the right thank you miss so anyways I'm just picking up some stuff before I go home and then uh, I've got to work the rest of the day I apologize if you came to this video thinking it was gonna be like oh my god today is my first day of Uber Eats and I made so much money I didn't I did and let me tell you something about my channel if you're new okay I'm just gonna show you how it is whatever is going on like I'm gonna show you if it's good if it's bad if I'm annoyed Your whatever it is, is on the right. if I did something stupid I'm gonna show you all right so if you're new here I would please ask you to subscribe to like to share and I will see you guys on the next one. Have a great day.